Hello everyone, this is Joanna and this evening I just wanted to um, share with you what it is that I'm up to really quickly. Um, as you know, I had on a manicure a few days ago that had the purple and I had used this plate um, with this image right here. And I had told a friend of mine that I could use stones and make a ring. Now these particular stones were not very clear at the bottom, so what I did, if I can show you here, was I just painted um, the top of the stone and then the back of the stone. And I kind of did it just like I did the nails. Um, so I don't know how clear this is showing. But the image that I used was off of this Conad Plate M78. And really quickly, I'll try to show you what I used. I used SE Full Seam Ahead. I just painted this on about three coats, um, maybe four. I just wanted the stone to be the color of the polish. And the stone started off clear. And then I also had used this, um, I guess it's Northern Lights out the door. I don't think this is showing very clear, but hopefully you can see that. And these are not in the order that I used them. I use my Conad Royal Purple Polish and at some point I put some of this um, Pirouette My Whistle. As you can see I've gone through this bottle. It's something that I've been using almost as much as I use my Fairy Dust. And of course um, I did the Seche Vite. I did not treat the stones with polish. I just, um, I mean with a base coat or anything like that. I just polish them with the polish and I use this little stamper right here. So as you can see, or maybe I'm hoping you can see, this piece of the heart stretched bigger than this one over here. And I don't know again if you can see that, so I'm going to try to hold that there. And I apologize for that because I still don't know how to make this phone focus. I don't know if I put it on something if it will focus. But see this heart isn't as big as this one. So what I plan to do with this for my friend is to put those on some ring bases for her daughter and like I said before I've always painted underneath the stone and, and I'm trying to get ideas with that ring that we got in the julep box because mine is still in the bag but I thought this was nice so I'm gonna keep one and I'm gonna give one to her and I really like that manicure when I did it in fact I left it on for a few days and I might redo it again um, and again it was this image plate here this is Conad M78 and this is one of my favorite favorite plates besides M66 and the one with the leopard because I thought I didn't like this image and it's really really pretty depending on what combination of colors you use. This is the one I use for my leopard look. This was what I got the plate for and I ended up loving this image more than anything. I absolutely love this image. So that was it. I just wanted to show you guys what I'm up to. Going to be making some little rings and necklace pieces and things like that and just giving them out to friends. Everyone have a great evening.